to bless the animals that fill our lives with joy. The animals of God's creation inhabit the skies, the earth, and the sea. They share in the fortunes of human existence and have a part in human life. God, who confers his gifts on all living things, has often used the service of animals or made them symbolic reminders of the gifts of salvation. Animals were saved from the flood and afterward made a part of the covenant with Noah. The Paschal Lamb brings to mind the Passover sacrifice and the deliverance from the bondage of Egypt. A giant fish saved Jonah. Ravens brought bread to Elijah. Animals were included in the repentance enjoined on humans. And animals share in Christ's redemption of all of God's creation. We therefore invoke the divine blessing on these animals through the intercession of St. Francis of Assisi. As we do so, let us praise the Creator and thank Him for setting us over other creatures of the earth. Let us also ask Him that remembering our human dignity, we may walk always in His law. From the book of Genesis. In the beginning, when God created the heavens and the earth, God said, Let the water teem with abundance of living creatures, and on the earth let birds ripen in it the dawn of the sky. And so it happened. God created the great sea monsters and all kinds of swimming creatures, with which the water teems, and all kinds of winged birds. God saw how good it was. God was then saying, be perfect, multiply, and build the water of the seas, and let the birds multiply on the earth. Even came, and morning followed the fifth day. Then God said, Let the earth bring forth all kinds of living creatures, cattle, creeping things, and wild animals of all kinds. And so it happened. God made all kinds of wild animals, all kinds of cattle, and all kinds of creeping things of the earth. God saw how good it was. Then God said, Let us make man in our image, after our likeness. Let them have dominion over the fish of the sea, the birds of the earth, and the cow, and over all the wild animals, and all the creatures that crawl on the ground. God created man in his image. In the divine image he created him. Male and female he created them. God bless them, say, be perfect and multiply, fill the earth and subdue thee, have dominion over the fish of the sea, the birds of the air, and all the living things that move on the earth. The word of God. Thanks. And let us pray. Blessed are you, Lord God, maker of all living creatures. You called forth fish in the sea, birds in the air, and animals on the land. You inspired St. Francis to call all of them his brothers and sisters. We ask you to bless these pets, these animals. By the power of your love, enable them to live according to your plan. May we always praise you for all your beauty and creation. Blessed are you, Lord our God, in all your creatures. And may the God who created the animals of this earth as a help to us continue to protect and sustain us with the grace his blessing brings, now and forever. Amen. Now, Father George and I will walk among you and bless you and the animals with holy water if you find that your animal would not react well to holy water. He's already, he or she has already been blessed, but uh, you're feel, feel free to tell us uh, not to sprinkle. While we're waiting, there is uh, coffee and bagels for sale over at the uh, sports tent. And if you did not yet get your certificate from the St. Francis Animal Shelter, they have a certificate waiting for you that your pet has been blessed this year. Thank you.
thank you all for coming out.